What's up Team Blitz? It's another day, another stretching. Today we're gonna do a back stretch and this stretch is really good if you spend your time working, sitting down a lot or if you just want to be flexible in your back even more. So let's do this. So what we're first gonna do is we're gonna start with taking three bets, inhaling and exhale. Last one. And exhale. Connect your fingers and hands behind your back and start opening up your chest. Interlace your hands and try keeping your arms straight. From here, relax, go down, bend your knees a little bit, and touch the ground. A tip here is to suck your st stomach in and just try to keep your stomach connected to your thighs and stand here. You can even go moving side to side. And straighten your legs. Two, three steps out and sit down in a sumo position and try keeping your back straight. If you want to put some more pressure and at the same time do a little challenge for your hip, you can use your elbows, connect your hands and push. But the most important thing here is to keep your back straight and your hip down. If your hands were up, take them down. Let your knees fall out. And we're gonna go to child pose. And relax. Think about your breath and just relax. We're gonna change position and we're gonna do cat and cow pose. So we're starting from this position and we're starting by arching our back and at the same time looking. Try to push as much as possible when you're arching, like really, really arch. And when you're going to cow, really, really push your back up. Good. Take a moment, just sit. From here, we go up on our knees place our right leg to the side and we put 
put our arms straight and we go to thread the needle in. Arm up and in. Really reach up and come in. to neutral position and we change and we're gonna do the other side so the left leg out from here we're gonna take our left arm up and thread the needle up. in really stretch up as much as you can and go in. Two more. And the last one. And come back in. From here. Lay yourself down and go to a spink position and stay here for 40 seconds. Focus on your breathing and feel how that arch From here, we're gonna do a spinal twist. So we're gonna start by taking up our right leg. We're gonna take our left hand going under the right, touching our knee, and then rotating back. This should be feeling in your, you should be feeling this in your spine, how it's twisting your back. And what you want is that you want both shoulders on the ground. And it's okay if your knee is not touching the ground. It doesn't have to be here. It can also be here, depending on your level. But what's most important is that you feel the twist in your spine. Turn your body. And we're gonna do the other side. So the lift leg up, the right hand under the left, touching your knee. I'm gonna switch my mic. Touching your knee. And then rotate the body. Place both your shoulders on the ground. And twist. So when you feel more from this stretch is when both your shoulders is in the ground, but you're pushing the knee, your, in this case, the, the left knee to the ground. This is when you feel the stretch the most. So sometimes I even use my right hand to push down the left knee to increase the stretch.
come back to the middle go down and we turn around laying her back and from here you want to hug your knees so let your knees come up hug your knees touching one hand on each elbow and stretch so what you want to do here in this stretch is that you want to push your knee through your hands up to the roof, uh, up to the, how do you say, up to the sky in this case, because you're outside. And you want your lower back to be straight and not bent. So at the same time, as you're pushing your knees up, you want to push your lower back down. And your bum down. From here, let your feet touch the ground. And we're gonna do a dynamic shoulder bridge. So push from here, your hip up, but at the same time, your arms come up. And let them go down. Push up, arch your back, and let them come back. Few more rounds. Come back. Last one. And we'll come back. Relax. And here, I want you to focus on pointing your toes and reaching your arms up. And we're just gonna stay here doing a full body stretch. So arms, hands going up and feet stretching down. You even want your lower back not to be touching the ground. So you want that little gap in between your back and the ground. So keep reaching. Ten more seconds. down to the side, heels together, feet relaxing to the side, palms up, and just lay here for a little while. Focus on your breath. Feel the gap in your lower back. How your chest is going up and down with your inhale and exhale. And just breathe normally.
come back up to seated position and we're done so thank you guys for this session this was a, a back session and uh, like i said if you're sitting down a lot at work or if you just want to be more flexible in your back or even if you had a back injury this is perfect to relieve pain and also to increase flexibility so thank you so much for joining me hope you have a good day it's all love mm -hmm.